Well, we're over at Rock River Arms with Steve Mayer. How are you doing, Steve? Good, yourself? Not too shabby. And uh, if you're not familiar with Rock River Arms, you have a wide variety of AR platforms. Yes, we do. Multi-calibers, multi-platforms, uh, multiple configurations within each. And you got some new products here at SHOT Show. We do. Uh, first one would be our 458 SOCOM Beast Carbine, 14 and a half inch bowl barrel, the new Beast Muzzle Brake, uh, TRO Handguard, Delta Stock, quite a little combination primarily as a hog gun, but all sorts of other applications for it. Very nice looking. Thank you. We've got the uh, 1911 P Polymer Pistols coming out uh, in the next couple of months, few months. It's a polymer framed 1911. Uh, a little bit wider than a single stack metal, a little narrower than a double stack metal, four ounces lighter. Oh, there's been a lot of talk about polymer 1911s. No one's actually been able to pull one off well in the past. How is it that you guys are able to finally get one out the door? We took our time in trying to develop it. We didn't just make it and sh ship it. <laughs> Excellent. How much of it is actually polymer? The entire frame. Very nice. And this should be out sometime this summer? Yeah. Excellent. Do we have a price point on that yet? Uh, we're aiming for uh, 8 to 850 retail. Very nice. We've got the uh, LAR 47. Should start coming out uh, in the next few weeks. It's our standard AR platform that takes a AK-47 uh, magazine in 7.62 by 39. Oh, that's kind of interesting. I know at our local store, it's much easier to get 7.62 by 39 than it is 2.23 sometimes. A lot of companies have tried to do a 7.62 by 39 AR in the past, and the weak spot was always the magazines. And they've come up with all sorts of oddball magazines over the years, and none of them are really all that good. Uh, we admit it, we don't make magazines real well. We're a rifle company, not a magazine company. So, you know, you look around and you say, there's millions and millions of AK magazines. Let's build the rifle around the magazine instead of the magazine around the rifle. So we came up with an AR platform that takes AK mags. That's pretty impressive. I'm, I know I'd be looking forward to getting my hands on one of those. Mm -hmm. and so far, it's worked with uh, pretty much every uh, metal, polymer, nylon, bimetallic, except for the drums. And that's just the nature of the way the drums rock into the mag well. And a couple of the lesser priced uh, AK mags that don't work out with our AKs that we have either. So there you go on that. Okay, so good quality mags and you're going to be good to go. Yep. Well, Steve, thank you very much for spending some time with us. Thank you.